men who entered the mortuary in Kisumu town through the bodies of the dead people and took everything away. This is a fact, Madam Speaker. It is also a fact that the same young men went into a supermarket belonging to a Mr. Hussein. They looted everything to the tune of uh, more than 200 million, Madam Speaker. This is a fact. In Nairobi here, there we have men who went to a supermarket in Gitangala. They looted quick. Uh, they looted everything, took everything away, Madam Speaker. Madam Speaker, it's also a fact that uh, we have seen on TV police officers being chased by this motion, Madam Speaker. This motion has been brought here to serve two purposes. One is to sanitize the same same fellas who are causing anarchy, who are arming young people in this country, who are destroying properties of innocent Kenyans, including police stations, Madam Speaker. This motion is also brought here, order. Madam Speaker. What is out of order, Honorable Masara? It is quite, thank you, Madam Speaker. It is quite unfortunate that Honorable Nidmas Barasa is misleading this house. Let him produce documents showing those who looted those supermarkets. It is in record in this country. Let us not reduce parliament to where somebody can talk. As somebody was charged by murder, killing people by gun, cannot come in this parliament and start lecturing order, people on order, issues order, of Honorable Masara. We order. Honorable Masara. Honorable Masara, you know the standing orders. I don't need to remind you. You are a repeat member. You are a repeat member, so I will ignore that one. So continue, Honorable Didmas. Madam Speaker, I said, and I want to repeat again here, that the aim of this motion is to intimidate the IG of the National Police Service, and I want to ask the IG not to be intimidated by this motion, and that Kenyans are with him. He must protect properties and the life of the Kenyan people, Madam Speaker. Madam Speaker, Madam Speaker. Order members, order members, what is out of order? It better be out of order, Honorable Rosa. Madam Speaker, I moved this motion because I wanted to discuss the brutality of the police, which is in the glaring lim limelight of everyone. Is the member in order? Is the member in order to claim that I, Rosa Akinyibuyu, brought in this motion so that it can be a cleansing act of some people that is imagining? Is he in order to... Honorable members, what? order members. No, no, order. no, Madam Speaker. Order members. Honorable Rosa, you've already raised your point of order. Madam Speaker. Honorable members, order. The Speaker approved this motion. It has gone through the scrutiny that is required. It is properly before this House. So even as we debate Honorable Didmas, let us restrict ourselves to the motion. And don't cast us passions to your colleagues, even on the other side. Madam Speaker. If you look at the content of the motion, it has got statistics that are not proven. Yes. And when you are debating a motion, you debate it in a language, it will package your facts the way you want to package your facts. So by me saying that the reason why this motion was brought here is to intimidate the National Police Service from discharging their constitutional duties, and I want to tell them, all the agencies, that Kenyans are with them. And uh, I want to make it very clear, honorable, honorable, honorable Madam Speaker. Madam Speaker, Madam Speaker, there are members from the opposition who have been hiding in my house in the southern quarters for fear of being arrested. I want to ask them to forget if they are continuing to engage in the things that are engaging them, let them be arrested, Madam Speaker. I will no longer provide refuge for suspected criminals who are destroying properties in this country, Madam Speaker. Order. Order Madam members. Speaker, protect me. Order members. Order. Order, Honorable Didmas. Order. 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 Order members. Order members. Honorable Milio Diambo. Honorable Bensuda. 
let us not shout across the aisle. Honorable Didmas, Honorable Didmas, Honorable Didmas, Honorable Didmas, I will just say, the people, how they came to your servants' quarters, please get them the same way, the same route they came. Get them the same way. Order, members, we order. Order, Honorable Mili. Order, Honorable Mili. Honorable Didmas, please, wind up. You only have a few minutes. Wind up. Continue. Madam uh, Speaker, I want to summarize by saying that are those leaders who will continue to radicalize the children of this country by arming them with machetes and rungus to loot and destroy public out of order. and the private out of properties. I, there should be no, nowhere these people should hide. The police should carry out their duties. The police should execute the constitutional mandate to protect life and properties, and those leaders who are found radicalizing young men, arming them with rungus and machetes, they should be dealt with, and the sponsors should be dealt with. Your time is up. Time is up. The next chance, the next chance, the next chance will go to the, to the member for Siaya, Honorable Christine Ombaka.